Let us know if you have any questions. Thank you so much. Thanks, we're having a baby. <laughs> <laughs> Shopping for a baby is super overwhelming. And even trying to look for things that fit little people, that's, to me, it's like, Get on your knees and then go baby shopping and see how successful you are. What else do we need? Crib. They have lots Fat of crib. This one's gorgeous. A little deep for us though. Be like, land safely. Like, use the ladder. Use the ladder. <clears throat> Let me try and get you. Or that. Yeah. Don't don't break the place. It would only be if like the child could come walk up to me. <laughs> That's why we're gonna have a normal sized kid. Average height. So you want you would prefer an average size child over everything? Yes. For the only reason that it it most likely would avoid surgeries. That's it. Mm -hmm. Average size child. Our child has a 25% chance of being an average stature child. I know lots of little people that have average sized children. Our baby could have severe skeletal issues. I had a surgery at five. My hips were out of their sockets. You've been lucky with no surgery. I do feel fortunate. I've only had ear surgery. A lot of the other women haven't been as lucky as myself when it comes to skeletal issues. Um, Tanya's had multiple surgeries. I know Tracy's had multiple surgeries. Christy, being little is sometimes a pain in the neck, literally. Let me just say this. If our kid has a million surgeries and a mil million health problems and a million other things, I will still love that kid no matter what, the same. I just want a healthy baby. <laughs>